Welcome back to another episode of Drink Tales. And today, so you guys know last week we uh, took a little tour with Independent Distilling mm -hmm. and we walked away. We bought a bottle of their single barrel apple brandy. Well, today we decided to do a little cocktail with it. Um, we're gonna make something up. See what you guys think about it. What are we making up? It's not too, I guess, intricate as it were. Mm -hmm. um, I took the blueprints for a whiskey sour and we're gonna go with that. As a matter of fact, if this turns out correctly, mm -hmm. I may already have the name for this cocktail. Okay. Well, we won't know that yet until I um, things happen. Uh, we're gonna start off with the juice of half a lime. Lemon. Lemon. Lime. It's a lemon. It's a lemon. And half an ounce of simple syrup made with brown sugar. Mm -hmm. And I added some allspice, some nutmeg, mm -hmm. and some cinnamon. Okay, in there. So you got a lot going on in here. Mm -hmm. um, I'm working on a theme with this apple brandy, and that's to try to do an apple pie in a glass. Okay. A boozy apple pie in a glass. Okay. Uh, but we're not done yet because we got another ingredient to add before we add our whiskey, and that's an egg white. Mm -hmm. Um. Since this is a whiskey sour, you're gonna use an egg white. They say the egg white is optional. I believe that there is no point to the whiskey sour if you don't. Because that's what you do with your trash. Okay, so far so good. Outlier number 12 from Independent Distilling. As you can tell, this is a fresh bottle that we're opening. We've already tasted it at the distillery. Mm -hmm. Got that apple taste, or smell as it were, but I mean the good stuff. Okay, now, because we are using an egg white, we need to dry shake this first. So we're not gonna put any ice in here just yet. All right. You can go away. Okay. Just... 
traditional garnish for a whiskey sour is you put some Angostura bitters on top. On the top. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna see if I can do this with some cardamom bitters. Why, now, why cardamom? Because cardamom is a flavor that goes well with the flavors that are in the simple syrup, such as the cinnamon, the nutmeg, the allspice, and that sort of thing. Okay. So I wanted to say on oh, theme as it were. Yeah, if you guys can tell I'm looking up at this. And you're supposed to make like a Froth is uh, looking very studly, so to speak. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys can get a whiff of that. You're gonna spill that. Okay. <laughs> so let's get a taste and uh, see what we got. It's pretty good. I get a whiff of that cardamom when I go in. Mm -hmm. Very smooth. I don't think it tastes too much like an apple pie, but it's pretty good. I like how the cardamom you in the nose. Mm -hmm. This is akin to a sour apple. Mm -hmm. I will say that. Mm -hmm. Like a green apple. Yeah, I like it. I mean, you technically weren't going to taste a whole ass apple pie mm -hmm. in the drink. But the sentiment is there. Mm -hmm. So what are you calling this? Uh, apple pie sour. Apple what? Apple pie sour. Okay. I'm still sticking to the apple pie thing. I'd say it was successful. And with that said, that'll do it for this episode of Drink Tales. Be sure to like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you're notified of all content coming to the channel. Also check us out on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Yeah, um, it's the end of the year. Mm -hmm. And, you know, with new endings come new beginnings mm -hmm. and I'm probably saying this a month early but I want to get this out of the way to basically say that you know if there are some booths and drinks and stuff like that you guys want to pass on to us or tell us where they are let us know about them so that we can go and do that for the new year mm -hmm. we like going to you know uh, various eateries and uh and uh liquid stations so to speak mm -hmm. bars breweries distilleries mm -hmm. speakeasies things of that nature restaurants you know let us know hit us up in our dms and let us know where these places are we want to know if they have the food and drink that you think is the best mm -hmm. and we want to be the judge of that mm -hmm. so that'll do it for this episode and until next time everybody peace